great to see all of us at the table today. There's so much amazing experience in IT. I mean, I think we've got decades plus. I won't quantify <laughs> how much, but I'd love to talk a little bit about kind of the value that AI is bringing um, to the marketplace, to your companies. Um, we talk a lot about productivity and efficiency. Maybe I'll start with you, Arnolfo. Sure. The value is, is twofold. There's a lot of repetitive tasks in accounting and finance. So first is eliminating a lot of that and giving time back to people, right? But I think what's more exciting is allowing people to be better at their job. Imagine the power of clicking a button to prep for your earnings release and have a script and a Q&A prep ready to go in a moment's notice. We love to call that supercharging humans. That's right. So we're leveraging AI like with our developers when it comes to code documentation or taking older code and upgrading it to newer code, really seeing a lot of value there. Does it improve the quality too? That's the one thing that's like really important. Like the level of quality really does go up and it really puts us in a position to be reviewers of that quality. One of the things we do um, for our services team is that AI is in the background chugging away at the data. And if you ask a question, it can now go and get the answer for you. And this has created an immense amount of speed and agility to be able to solve problems faster and allowing us to spend more time um, pushing the human element, which is people. And then, you know, from value and how you tie that into security, how do those come together? We spent the last three years of our company really getting ready for this moment. We have completely transformed our finance, our human resources areas, sales with new enabling technology to really be ready with high quality data. And as the capabilities have improved, we're now starting to really deploy um, a significant amount of AI for our employees to be more productive, but we're also doing it in a way where we're meeting our employees where they're at. What you're saying is that it's now everybody mm -hmm. who gets to engage with the AI, and this is really why there's a transformation or a revolution, if you will, because it's affecting every person and every job. You guys have been a great example of how you've kind of trained your people and leaned into skills to make sure that they have the right AI experience and background. A lot of the times people are like, oh, you need a technical skill. And I'm here to say it's not a technical skill, it's a skill of interpretation. We have to have the spirit of discernment on how to start at a super advanced spot and then take it to a place that we've never been before. Let's talk a little bit about speed and agility. It's so important. How have you incorporated AI to really help embrace that? So at Datastax, we actually think about a, a company's journey in three stages. The first one is they'll decide to delegate a lot of work to generative AI and get, as an example, 30% savings. The next stage will be accelerate. Not only will they be able to get that cost savings, but they're also gonna focus on effectiveness and efficiency of their workforce, right? So that's when the apps are gonna start getting very cool. What's gonna get very, very cool is they'll reinvent their business and their P&L will completely transform because AI will drive growth for those businesses. And some businesses will zigzag along, some will stop at a certain point, but th that's how we think of a company's journeys through AI over, over time. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I, I absolutely love, I mean, you just talked about a digital workforce with personality and people that you can delegate to that are right. augmenting your workforce. We're in a digital age, an AI age. It's no longer you can survive on the old soups and nuts. Yep. You have to evolve. Well, I just want to thank you all for an amazing conversation. You are all taking it forward. I love it. So thank you. Thank, thank you. you.